Listen, man, the animals are mad. For some strange reason, they mad and they taking over. I don't know why what's going on right now, but it's interesting. So we about to check out another video. This one here is when a polar bear meets a hungry orca. Let's go. In the wild, there's a constant survival challenge. Where today's chaser might be tomorrow's runner. Sometimes animals wind up in spots they never planned on visiting. We're about to dive into stories of wildlife that took a wrong turn with some wild consequences. This is why humans need dogs. So when a mama polar comes clawing at you, you've always got a tough defense. Yeah. Although, if this polar bear was alone, she would have easily taken the dogs down. It seems both sides were acting to protect. Yeah, you could tell she's too. She's more worried about the the the, cub, the kids or her children. You could tell she's focused on that. She's just really trying to back them off and create space for uh, kids to get away. For her cubs, the yeah. others for their human. <laughs> Hippos are extremely territorial, so much that even crocodiles will cross even their path. Fast. Well, some of the smarter ones, anyway. And if you're daring enough to step into hippo territory with that many of them out there, yeah, you've pretty much signed away the rights to your life. One crocodile's silly mistake ended up costing it so much more when all of the hippos decided to toss it around like it was a ball. A crocodile ventured into the watering hole dominated by elephants and paid the price. Crocodile is still alive. One juvenile elephant took serious offense to the intruder and wasn't willing to share its safe space. It doesn't have tusk. If we forget how powerful ele uh, elephants are, man, because they're just so meek and mild mannered. They just, you know what I mean? But when they get mad, I don't know if y'all recently seen the safari trip. This is why I don't go on safaris. Y'all seen this, the recent event with the safari trip and the lady and they, the elephant just came charging at them, pushed over the vehicle and killed the lady. <laughs> like, don't get it twisted, bro. Alien, I, why do I keep wanting to say aliens? Elephants are to be feared grabbed the crocodile by the tail and gave it a good few shakes until the croc accepted its fate. I have video, I have video. Deep down on the ocean floor, migratory crabs pulled a surprising twist when one octopus tried to grab one of the smaller crabs. Eventually, the crab army takes over the octopus. Dang. Leaving behind nothing but regret I guess they were really mad for their brethren. Either that, or Squidward tried asking Mr. Krabs for a raise. All out of money! This bear had a hankering for bacon. But whoa, this didn't go the way I was expecting. These pigs really managed to fight one of the world's craziest predators and lived to tell the tale. <laughs> Do you think sharks are ruthless? Oh! 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 Cool, check this one out. burying into the ground to literally dig out an octopus, oh. only to get inked deep into its lungs. Yep, this shark will be puffing black bubbles for weeks. This encounter between a moray eel and an octopus will give you chills. The moray eel was clearly set on having a great meal, so it lunched. But got a mouthful of black ink instead. But the resilient eel didn't back off. The ink wasn't enough to ward it off, and so began a stomach churning battle between the two. Eventually, the eel completely forgets its initial motivation and simply lets go because it knows it won the game. This apex predator thought it found a good meal with a scurrying isopod, but little did it know the food would fight back.
in an instant. The isopod, which is a deep sea scavenger and typically feeds on decaying matter on the ocean floor, topples the shark and gives it a whirlwind of emotions. This played out in India's Todoba National Park, where soaring temperatures and lack of prey forced this tiger and sloth bear cubs to share the same watering hole. This hungry tiger's skillful lunge at what it thought was an easy meal turned into a brutal battle as Mama Bear came out with her claws and didn't hesitate to turn that tiger into pulp. The two tossed and turned, and for a second, you'd think the tiger won, but the ferocious sloth bear mother emerged victorious. This one decided to test the- I, I stand corrected. I would have never guessed that. I would have put my money on the tiger. Wow. Limits of its stupidity by continuously squaring up with the camel. But even the most docile of creatures run out of patience. After numerous unwarranted tugs and almost bites, the camel, which had been rebuffing the donkey's actions, finally gave it back. And boy, did the camel not hold back. Even the donkey knew its actions were bad after this good comeback. You can see regret pouring all over its face. Well, too bad now. Ooh. Headbutting is a way for rams to show domination, but the tactic doesn't work if they don't choose their opponents wisely. Although a buck may seem like one to fold the battle, it's got its own set of defensive tools to use. And here it goes. The ram's attempts to steer the buck end up pushing it back and back. And it doesn't look like the buck's going to stop until it kicks the ram out. <laughs> look at it run away. Here's something you don't see every day. The king of the jungle tried to secure a buffalo meal, but got cornered instead. A buffalo herd's protective instinct is like no other. And here it is, casually driving a- That makes me mad. Did y'all see that safari vehicle? It don't look like it was covered at all. Hold on. Instinct is like no other. Look at that. Look at how out in the open they are. What if that lion just decided to turn around and say, oh, if I can't eat this buffalo, I got humans right here. I look like I got access to and lunged and jumped on there. What is up with these safari rides, man? <laughs> and here it is, casually driving a lion up a tree. <laughs> That lion's lucky it's nimble on its paws. Otherwise, it would be taking a few headbutts and kicks to its face. The poor guy had to spend hours on that tree, and even then, it wasn't safe. Look at that stone cold herd. I bet that kitty isn't curious anymore. You know what? That taught me something, too. Now I, I need to know that lions can also climb a tree as well. Didn't know that. Roosters are often seen as guardians of their hens. In the presence of danger, their instinct is to alert and protect. The hawk, on the other hand, is a skilled hunter, looking for an opportunity. Who will win in this rather unexpected encounter? The predator swooping in on vulnerable prey, or the man of the house? While the hen puts up a fight, the rooster raises its beak. Oh, this rooster isn't letting anyone take his partner away. Well done. This Cape Buffalo was stupid enough to challenge someone twice its size. But I guess vanity often paves the way for stupidity. The rhino took it all in stride, possibly wondering why its opponent was acting out. And then its patience wore thin. Don't stand a chance. <laughs> and the buffalo got a taste of what we call true strength. Bulls. They're often headbutting their opponents regardless of who they are. For most of them, headbutting is a way to show their strength. But sometimes, some bulls headbutt unlikely opponents just for the fun of it. And occasionally, they'll get a taste of their own medicine like this one, which faced retaliation so bad that it had to take a few minutes to get back up. If you think rhinos are aggressive, you're right.
But if you think elephants are gentle giants, <laughs> you couldn't be more wrong. This rhino didn't know what it was getting into uh -uh. when it challenged the elephant to a duel. The tusked creature almost believed it could win, but when the elephant walked in its direction, that rhino knew it had messed up. Uh -huh. But look at that! It still kept firm! A decision it'll regret in three, two, one. <laughs> Over. Over. And that was so smart, the way the elephant played that. He knew once, all I just need to do is to get close to you where you can't charge. As soon as I get close to be able to lean on, it's over. It's over. <laughs> it's over. Imagine that. The rhino running off as if it's throwing a tantrum. Now that's embarrassing. <laughs> A bride of lions kept tormenting a lizard who was just trying to bask in the sun. If that wasn't bad enough, the pride wasn't even doing it to make a meal, but purely out of fun. Luckily, an enraged buffalo leapt at the scene, and its thunderous hooves drove away most of the lions. For the one that remained, the buffalo launched it into the sky to relentlessly bully the lizard. Now that's one way to get the entire pride to walk off. An eagle stuck in its enclosure in Featherdale Wildlife Park in Sydney surprised visitors when it retaliated magnificently against a heron that tried to steal its food. The heron probably assumed the eagle would be too restricted to protect its food. But little did it know, such barriers rarely cloud a predator's defense. Oh, oh Jesus! Jesus. <laughs> well, that's a grip like no other. The heron will never mess with the eagle again. The moral of the story is, don't stick your beak where it doesn't belong. In a boxing match between two kangaroos, one has to emerge victorious. But when this kangaroo tackled the other, it didn't predict the loser would be itself. And that, too, in such an embarrassing way. Imagine telling all your kangaroo friends you lost because Roger managed to sucker punch you out of the arena. Well, at least the ladies know who to approach. This might be the first time you're seeing a lion tiptoe. Lions typically tiptoe when they're stalking their prey. But sometimes they can put their stealthy stalking behavior to humorous use. <laughs> I don't know what this lion was thinking, but waking up his wife was a recipe for disaster from the- uh, uh, The reason why I'm laughing because we all do that. We all do that to our significant other, man. Wait till they laying down just peacefully and quietly sneak up and we do the same thing just to make them mad. Very beginning. Well, at least it's nice to know husbands are mischievous no matter the species. <laughs> Crocodiles naturally blend in with their environment, so animals don't often realize they're drinking from a croc-infested pool. That's bound to attract trouble. And here it is. What a lucky escape! This bushbuck will be praying to the gods tonight, and I bet that croc's feeling that ashamed close. now. This juvenile elephant's attempts to cool off turned into a horrifying battle of survival. Oh, cool. When the determined croc wouldn't let it go. It's a good thing the elephant had its entire herd nearby. An elephant herd is extremely protective and will abandon all things to protect its babies. About to be a bad day for that croc. Rest in peace to this croc. And this crocodile got the brunt of it. Well, considering what elephants can do, surviving is the best case scenario. It's best not to eat in public where you know you'll attract hungry dwellers. But what makes this dog's actions worse is when you find out the food bowl wasn't even his own. 
it had been left out by the donkey's owner, but the dog took to it first. Luckily, that donkey was patient enough and even let out a few soft warnings. But the dog mistook kindness for defeat and kicked the mess with a good old kick to the face. I knew it. I knew it. In the animal kingdom, the size and strength of an elephant's tusks can play a significant role in fights. So when these bull elephants got locked in a tussle for domination, it was pretty easy to predict who was going to win. But that didn't stop the younger, less experienced bull elephant from going all out. Of course, the bigger elephant simply knocked it back, eventually forcing it out of the arena and their territory. But the true salt in the wound is realizing the defeated bull elephant also lost out on its chance to get lucky. An alligator tried sneaking into a horse's territory, hoping to snatch one of the foals. It even tried blending in with the environment to fool the horse family into thinking it was safe. Luckily for the family, the head of the house was galloping nearby. The minute the stallion realized its family was in danger, it gave the alligator a good old beatdown. Well, we know this stallion isn't horsing around. That, my friends, was a lion free-falling after being punted like a potato sack into the air. This lion snuck into a buffalo herd to secure a meal, but the minute it lunged at a buffalo calf, the rest of the herd surrounded the lion and began a thunderous march to drive it into the air. This lynx decided to tackle the resting coyote out of nowhere and paid for its unprompted tackle with several nips and scratches. Well, you know what they say about cats and curiosity. This one's lucky the coyote backed away. <laughs> Judging by her health, this lioness has probably been kicked out of the pride and is solo hunting. <laughs> Although it really hasn't worked out in her favor. Mm -hmm. So she goes for the stupidest possible option. Mm -hmm. In hindsight, we'd all react like this when woken up from a nap. Like, she need to go vegan. Like, <laughs> she made the bad choice. She needs to go vegan. An Asian giant hornet ventured into a beehive to hunt and ended up taking one of those bees' lives. Now, spare you the graphic details, but these bees can generate intense heat with their movement, which can be life threatening. Well, no more bees for this hornet. This is what happens when you cross an angry mother. A mother rabbit got just in time to save her bunnies from a hungry snake trying to lure them out from their hiding hole. And boy, she did not let the snake catch a break. The entire ordeal goes on for a few minutes until she finally stops and the snake makes a break for it. It looks like Mother Rhino forgot to give this one a few important lessons about respecting others. <laughs> oh. Yeah, there you go that rhino's first ever migraine. <laughs> first chance to experience a migraine. <laughs> Ouch! You can go crying to your mother now, Rhino, but it's probably too late to treat that sore ego. Oh. Yep, go get your aspirin now. <laughs> Is there anything scarier than seeing a hissing, venom-releasing machine sauntering its way towards you? Instead of making a break like most sensible animals would, this deer remained in the Komodo's territory and even attempted to kick the Komodo's face. And that's when it got the bite. If you didn't know, Komodos don't chase after prey. All they need to do is flick their prey, delivering their venom, and it's over. These bees outside the hive tried to ward off the snake's attempts, but the reptile kept pushing through. And then it finally forced its way inside. And that's when it emerged covered in bees. And I'm assuming heaps of painful stings. Ouch! 
The minute this tiger chased that monkey up the tree, it began to realize how high it truly was. But it didn't matter, as long as it was able to secure dinner. But the monkey realized this, and devised a plan to drive the tiger higher and higher, until gravity came into play. Look at that tiger pretending as if it didn't just fall. It's not only its body, but its feelings that were hurt too. Pride is hurt. <laughs> this sheep only wanted to cuddle the cat and was eagerly seeking pets. But the black kitty decided it was too good for some cross-species affection and decided to give that sheep a good few smacks instead. But the minute Mr. Whiskers looked away, the sheep kicked it out. This leopard continuously approached the lizard despite the reptile flicking its tail, signaling the leopard to go away. But the persistent cat remained curious and didn't stop its advances until the lizard had had enough. It raised its tail and, like a mighty warrior, swatted the leopard as if it was a mosquito. Now that feline's got a sore face and a sore ego. A leopard attempts to take advantage of a dole's successful hunt by stealing its kill, a risky move given the dole's capabilities. Although the Asiatic wild dog wasn't on the site when it happened, it returned with a vengeance. With just a little nibble, it spooks the leopard, which decides the unexpected resistance and potential for injury isn't worth the steal. Oh, dogs are lovable goofballs, but sometimes they can be pretty annoying. This kitty decided it couldn't wait anymore and instantly delivered some karma. That pupper is going to be watching its mouth for the rest of its life. <laughs> it's pretty cowardly to steal another animal's meal, especially when you're a wolf pack capable of hunting. But it's downright stupid to do this to a wolverine. And although this one's severely outnumbered, its fierce personality is enough to keep it going for hours. Look at these otters trying to bully the wise orangutan, and prompting it to pick up a stick and try to shoo them away like an old man with a cane chasing kids off his lawn. Why does an orangutan have a switch, bro? Why, why is that so funny? <laughs> Why does a orangutan have a switch, man? Well, at least they stopped yapping at the orangutan for now. But something tells me they'll probably do it again. When will animals learn not to mess with a hippo? This hyena probably thought it would be able to escape scot-free after trying to mess with a hippo. No. But the thunderous giant was simply waiting for the hyena to turn yep. its back. Sneaking up behind a leopard? I don't know what this leopard is thinking, but spooking a big cat is never going to end well, even if you're one yourself. Too bad for it, though. The second leopard was clearly wise with age and experience, skillfully dodged the tackle, and gave the smaller one a good lunge to remember. And here's another shocking moment from the Animal Kingdom. This lion tried to steal one of the buffalo calves, but ended up being driven up the tree by the herd instead. The king of the felines tried descending the trees a few times, but every time, the buffaloes would rebuff its attempts. Eventually, the buffalo stopped amusing the kitty and let it down. Known for its nimble-footedness and skilled hunting, the leopard rarely finds itself on its tiptoes high above a tree, hoping to find the ground. Come down as if you're going towards the issue point now. But for this feline, a thrilling pursuit to hunt a baboon led it to its downfall, quite literally. <laughs> the baboon cleverly drives the leopard mad as it tries to catch up, but it can't keep up with gravity and takes a tumble down. Ouch! That leopard will go home with an empty stomach and a bruised ego. There's not much hope left when you're surrounded by a pride of lionesses. These beastly felines rarely leave a meal running. But when you're a buffalo bull with tough skin and an attitude to take on everything head-on, 
chances are you might give that pride something to remember. Yikes! That lioness won't be returning to the battlefield for quite a while. This German Shepherd is clearly barking up the wrong tree. Or horse, and receives a well-deserved kick. Every time. Well, that's one way to cure a dog's aggression. <laughs> a white Be humble. Sit down. <laughs> Be humble. Bill Boar decided to challenge a pig sow. The confrontation turned into an intense showdown. The pig sow, showcasing incredible strength, managed to send the boar packing. In this town, it seems there's only space for one ruler of the roost. And clearly, the boar isn't the one wearing the mm. crown. A mama bear versus a northern giant. That's a battle that's literally only been seen once. 